Hi, this is Chris Campbell at Adobe Systems. In this video, I'm going to show you how to easily fix Windows permission problems that you might be having with Flash Player. This can usually be seen by uh, an install Flash Player working fine, but after rebooting your computer, you'll go to a web page and it will tell you that you need to install Flash Player again. Uh, the other scenario that might happen is you've installed Flash Player as an administrator and you log into a standard user account and you find that you're unable to see Flash Player content with that standard user. Sometimes disabling UAC fixes it for the standard user, but this should hopefully take care of it without having to disable UAC. So the first thing you wanna do is make sure that you have Flash Player installed. The next step you're going to do is download the sub in ACL utility from Microsoft. This is an MSI file that will download I've already done it here, and we're going to run it and install it in the default location. So we'll go through and agree. One main thing here is we need to remember where we installed it. So I'm just going to copy this into my clipboard with Control C. Hopefully that worked. But basically it's in my, since I'm on a 64-bit machine, it's in my program files x86 Windows Resource Kits Tools folder. Okay, now that that's installed, we need to grab a batch file that I have attached to this FAQ. It's called reset underscore fp11.bat.zip. Um, I'll have it in this FAQ, but we'll probably also update um, one of our knowledge base articles so you can find it there too. Uh, eventually, what we'd like to do is fix the installer and we'll work on doing that as soon as possible. And then you won't have to do this step at all. But until then, this batch file will help. So I've already downloaded it and I'm gonna open it up here and I need to extract this out and move it into the folder that I just installed sub in ACL. So I'm gonna go and create a new Explorer window. And I'm going to paste in the location. And you'll see that there's the sub in acl.exe file. If you don't see the .exe, that's fine. You might just see it say sub in acl. You can always turn on extensions by going into organize, folder and search options, view, and then we need to say, uh, uncheck this hide extensions for known file types, but it's not required. That's the ex application right here. I'm gonna go back here. I'm gonna grab reset. And we're gonna drag it over. We'll hit okay. We need to be doing this as an administrator or you need to at least have administrator rights to write into this folder. Okay, so now that that's there, we have the batch file and the exe in the same location. We're going to right click on the batch file and we're going to say run as administrator. This is going to bring us another prompt. We'll hit yes and you'll see a whole bunch of stuff go by on the screen. It should only take a few seconds to run. Okay, and now that it's done, you hit any key and the screen will go away. And if we reboot our computer, Flash Player should work as expected. If you have any questions or comments, please come to the Adobe Flash Player forums and let us know, or you can reply and comment on this video. Thanks.